Hello, guys. Yeah, so um, tonight we are going to talk a little bit about um, the new versions of this uh, space time on the daily uh, date selections, yeah, the usage of daily date selections. So, um, before that, I want to let you guys know that actually um, these new versions uh, is not as good that you can see from the old one, but there's some other details that we also needed in these new versions that uh, provide us with a new way to understand more about Chinese metaphysics and the way we use it on a daily basis. Yeah. So um, let me uh, share the screen first. Okay. Because when we go into uh, date selections, yeah, when we want to go into date selections, so we would like to have um, different view that uh, we wanted, okay? Yeah, we want to have a different view that we can actually use it uh, to help us in our daily activities, okay? So at the top sections here, this is already our nature chart. So a lot of us actually get confused in this part. So before going that, yeah. A lot of all of us actually get confused when you're using the new one because these sections turns around uh, differently, yeah. And uh, you can you can actually close down your nature chart to have better view on uh, the date selections or even the achievement chart that you want to plot. Okay, so I have told this before, but I'm going to remind you guys again. Yeah? This will be the place that you can close down, uh, like hide your nature chart, okay, hide your nature chart, so that you can have better view at the bottom sessions. So the old versions doesn't have the functions at all, okay? So that's why you'll be very, very hard to scroll up uh, on the bottom side. So these versions that they provide you with uh, new uh, functions to hide these, uh, these sections to let you have better view at the bottom side, okay? So now, um, before we go into uh, the date selections, I, mean, I want you guys to make sure that uh, you pick the right expansions, okay? So I've already done one date selections here that mainly that I will use all of the parcel pillar interactions because we need to know the day uh, energy uh, to use, okay? So we have this branch, uh, pillar branches uh, about the combinations. Today, is it good for me or not? Is it going to combo with me? Is it going to clash with me or not? Okay, this is one of the things that uh, we, need, we need to know because when you're using date selections, um, we need to know that whether this is a combo day or this is a clash day and combo with which pillar, clash with which pillar. Okay, that will give you an over, overall view that which uh, sec sections or aspect that you want to go into to improve yourself, okay? You want to go into uh, improving yourself, okay? So, uh, the 12 day officer, 28 constellations, yellow, black, and Tongkung is one of the most important uh, date selections, sections that you need to have, okay? So, pillar center, this is just different descriptions of the pillar. This is not very, very important, but some of us, if you want to learn transmitter physics, the more you get information from, that is the most good uh, things that you can get for free. Okay? That's why when some descriptions are very robust to keep on reading it, and you will get some uh, insight on what is this Peter for. Okay? Then we have uh, Peter Timerologies, Attribute and Properties. This is one of the best thing in the new versions that directly tells you what is this element represent in many, many di different categories. Later on, I will tell you about that. Solar term, uh, current 15 day cycle. This is the Jie Qi, yeah, that we use 24 um, solar, um, let's just say it's a season. Okay, which season is represented by which season is countering or, or is it good or not? So some of uh, the practitioner actually use one of this way to do date selections. Okay, to understand uh, is this, is this uh, season good with which kind of element, which kind of uh, animal branch? Okay, 
So we have um, element balance distributions of elements. Okay, this I think is the, um, the direct interactions between the two. Okay, then we have Peter cycle. This is a progressions timeline. I just pick it in so that I can use it later on. Okay, Pila is a, uh, this is a hexagram. Yeah, this hexagram is a bit special because it's provide you different kind of a hexagram in just one pillar. Okay, so it might confuse to you if you didn't know which one to use. Okay, I also mainly use, only use one system uh, at that moment. Okay, it just gives you the idea how you use it. Okay, so pillar flow, the energy current among pillars. Uh, this is the, like just now the one I say, I think this is the, the, the whole pillar interactions. Okay, then we have the, the current of element relations. So when you pick all these things, it will appear inside your date selections sections. Okay, because we put this all this plotter, we, we call this a different plotter inside uh, that sections that you want, okay, or the name that the, the, the column that you created. Okay. Then we have a pillar void, uh, fan yin, fu yin, yeah. Uh, pillar classical, so some classical uh, old text was put it in, okay. Then symbolic, uh, we have a nature pillar, a pillar stream. This is the jia stream that I mentioned in the previous versions. That actually, we have six uh, jia, uh, jia stream, uh, six jia stream. Okay. Oh, what was the name already? I just read it a few days ago. Okay. So we have the nut yin melody, yeah. The nut yin is the melody, okay. So this is the column of date selections that is actually almost the same with the pattern interactions. Okay, so I pick it all this up to have it inside that sections that let us know how to use it or read it or give us more information later on. Okay, so normally when we are going to do some date selections we are going to pick a new date, okay? But uh, whatever you guys have to remember is remember which is the animal combo with you, which is the animal that clash with you is most important, okay? So that you can know how to use this almanac calendar, okay? So this is the sections for the almanac calendar. And in here, you can directly see actually um, which is the good date for you, okay? Maybe you have, let's just say you have, uh, this is the ox combo with red, okay? So you want to pick, pick a red right here, uh, red day, okay? Then you will need to see, you will need to understand uh, this red day, how to use it. So when you go into term, in terms of a uh, 12 day officer, um, 12 day officer actually, um, the system is following the animal sign. Okay, so each one, one animal must govern one of the officer. Okay, so this year, uh, this month, uh, red was actually governed the stable officer. Okay, govern the stable officer. So when you backtrack, when you backtrack it, uh, you will still see. Uh, the red actually is together with the stable day, stable 12 day officer. Okay, this is the way that you use date selections. You need to understand the combo, you need to understand which of serial star is that that give you that um, the way to use the energy. So in these new versions, you need to remember all the auxiliary star that represented, okay? Because uh, then there is no more automatically coming out or showing you which auxiliary star is following you and more. Okay, so you need to remember which animal is which. Okay, but uh, inside this new space site, it still show you which is the animal that you will need to find later on. Okay, tapping into this amana no longer give you uh, the directions and the the redirect to another sections anymore. Okay, tapping into one of this uh, one of these uh, dates will direct you directly into the dates, and then you have to go back to the main page. Yeah, the main page will change into the date that you already tapped in. Okay, let's just say um, let's just say today 
I wanted to, today is, um, I think today is 28, right? Okay, 29 already. Okay, so I, let's just say I pick on 30. Okay, then you saw this day we directly change. Okay, so let's say I, uh, I tap another day. Yeah, you see the top sections already changed, right? Okay, and then if you guys uh, didn't saw these sections, okay, if you guys didn't saw these sections, you just need to tap here. Okay, then the sections will come up. Okay, like this, you close it down. You tap it again, you come up. If you wanted to pick date, okay, you just need to go here. Okay, you want to pick another date, direct it into that date. Okay, you can also press this refresh button for the current, the current time, current hour. Okay, so this is the almanac for you to choose. Okay, inside here, that will tell you that today is a close day, it's a net constellations, it's a jet core yellow black. Okay, the plus and minus. Plus, minus is for the Tonggong uh, good. Okay, plus is positive, dash is negative. Okay, so of course you will pick the, uh, the plus day, right? Then, uh, then you will see that the, the year killing, the month killing, okay? Uh, this is the clash year because gold is clashing with the ox. Okay, so this is the way that you see in the Amana. Okay, but mainly when you're going to use this, you are going to personalize to yourself. So you're not picking dates for other people, but for the general, okay? So do remember your combo and your clashes. Okay, so then um, let's go back into the main page. Okay, so I will close down the nature chart to give a better view. Okay, this will become the current time and hour. Okay, this will become the current time and hour. Okay, so because that I uh, already set up a new section, a new corner. Okay, e at the expansion there, yeah, and then this will come up. Yeah. But sometimes you didn't see it because after you're tapping one of the pillar with uh, one of the pillar, you have to already close down the interactions. Okay, so then you have to tap it back. Okay, and all these uh, interactions, uh, the, the column, the plotter that you already made, you come up by itself. Okay, so I press refresh first. Yeah, refresh today is 29. I tap into the day pillar. Okay. So uh, today is roaster day. 29 is a roaster day. And uh, it actually has harm. Okay. Have harm with one of my pillars. Okay. Self harm means that actually harm with the man pillar. It never represents here anymore. It will never tell you about it, but it will let you know that something is happening. Okay, something is happening. No longer like the old versions. Okay, no longer like the old versions. The old versions already tell you that uh, is it today is a combo day? Is it today is a harm? Is it a self harm? Okay, self penalty actually is a self harm. Okay, this is a self penalty, it's a self harm. And um, directly have the interactions happen at that moment. Okay, but now you no longer have that. Okay, so. pillar, whenever you tap into one of them, the interactions will directly focus on that pillar. Remember, yeah? Even when you're doing achievement plotting or forecasting, okay? Remember to press refresh, press, press refresh, and also tap into the hour pillar. So you will get the hour chart. So many of them actually get confused, okay? So now let's close the nature chart. Okay, so we left in the current chart. We press the refresh. Okay, we press the refresh. Okay, then um, because today we are talking about date selections. Okay, so when you tap into, let me say I tap into the day right now. Yeah, you will see that actually we have uh, self harm for the day, but you do not know which one is it. So you need to find it out. Yeah. Okay. Now, so then we have the the day informations which is the remove there, consolations of house, 
yellow black black of this. Yeah. In the old versions, you tap in, you see the information for the day and the constellation. What is suitable or not suitable? Now, because this is an advanced plotter, yeah, advanced new update space time, you guys need to remember it by yourself. Okay? So here, even you type in it, you only change the name uh, to Chinese word. Yeah. So you guys need to do notes right now for yourself. Okay. And then we go into the day sentences. Okay. This is one of the um the benefit of the new new date selections that it tells you that uh the actually as uh, heaven, earth, and man actually represent the whole pillar of the day. Okay, the whole pillar of the day. Okay, the heaven actually means the heaven stem, the earth actually the animal branch, and then the man is the hidden chi, the, the main chi at the bottom. Okay, so at the top, it tells you that today uh, we have this uh, yin earth. So yin earth is represented by what? Okay, up above, heaven is contracting, stabilizing the situations is uh, 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 earth uh, enduring uh, fertility. Yeah? So you will account encounter accountable influence and indirect rulers. Okay? Why? Because uh, this yin earth is 7k. Okay? Then uh, this is the animal branch that show you uh, what is it happens around this rooster? Okay, because today is the rooster day. So, what is it the rooster? Okay, so it mentioned to you also the lung become active. Okay, courage and smell take present means that today you might uh, have more courage to do things. Okay, because um, for you is an uh, indirect resource. Okay, so why is it courage and smell take present? This is the sentence for it. Yeah, then you have the main chi is IR too. So uh, I think IR means the input, uh, the interact the advisor or idealistic means that today actually you have self growth. Yeah, okay. Then at the bottom, yeah, this is also one of the benefit for using the new space time. Okay, what if what is G of or Yin of to you? Okay. Accountable influencer. So this place actually you can change to, to see um what is it sounds useful to you to do for today. Yeah. Okay. So then you have uh you have the details, the number, is it the yin priority? What is the element? Okay. Then you will see actually the property, uh, this is the details, the definitions for it. Okay. This is the part that you will be used to learn Chinese metaphysics. So in this G earth, this yin earth actually is a nourishing, receptive, transformations, resourceful, okay? Because um, G earth is a soil, soil that actually nurturing other plants to, be, to grow and become better, okay? So the different definitions you tell is the gentle, stabilizing force, and uh, this is distinguishable features, okay? Beginning consumer, okay? So you can also use this as uh, what you wanted to do today to give you an idea to what to do, okay? So the element, it tells you the element, okay? The properties, uh, what kind of elements is it? This will represent the element, the earth element, okay? This is no longer the single priority of that uh, G earth, okay? This is the whole element thing, okay? So it tells you that what action can you go to, yeah, the things, okay, the directions, uh, time is uh, transitions means that uh, it's in the middle, yeah. So uh, definitions is phase of transformation, changing states. Okay, then here is the best part. Yeah, when you want to learn Chinese metaphysics, you're going to remember all these things. Okay, body is spleen and stomach because soy can absorb things. Yeah, can uh, nutrient things, can uh, absorb a lot of water. So this is a body part for soy. It, uh, for earth, okay, it means spleen and stomach. Okay, the planet is when you are trying to uh, understand how astrology works in the uh, in battle. Then it will tell you that earth actually represents by Saturn. Okay, then you have the taste, you have the sense, emotions. Okay, 
a finger with the finger color was the, the, the color representing yeah then you have the industry that is uh, one of the best thing when you want to uh, understand your friends the highest element is represented by what kind of industry when doing parts of reading this is uh, this is very useful okay the same view goes into the animal sign yeah because the, the heaven man and uh, the heaven earth and man okay so we tell you actually uh, this animal sign can represent which uh, of the meaning informations okay so it will tell you that part okay until the the main parts the main chi okay then uh, this is the solar term this is the the, uh, the season the 24 season that have inside parts chart or inside the part reading yeah so this is the term of the solar Okay, so it will tell you that what is it right now uh, benefit to who? Okay, will benefit to who? Okay, benefit to matter, benefit to uh, to matter. Matter when you go into the season, benefit to matter. Matter represents sadness. Okay, so matter becomes stronger. So this is the place that when you use or um, to see whether the uh, the season is supporting what kind of element. Okay, so their, uh, their element balances, this is the, the, the regarding the whole uh, day pillar interacting with your battle chart, okay, interacting with your natal battle chart, okay. So, which is the, the, uh, the element that increase, which is the element that decrease, okay? and this is also the best part that you can use for um, understanding what you can do for today, okay. Then, um, then we have the day cycle, okay. This cycle actually means that um, this actually means uh, what is it happening to you at that period of time? Day, one day, one month, or one year? Okay, or one year. So um, you will need to understand this uh, a little bit further when you study uh, more into arts or date selections. Yeah. Then this is the hexagram. So the hexagram actually have a lot different uh, hexagram that represent to you. So use what you're familiar with. And I'm only familiar with the pillar. Pillar mean part. Yeah, pillar mean part. Okay, this is the flow. Flow means that um, interacting between your natal chart with today, the current time. Okay, so this have two sides of it. One is it is uh, the day. When you see GF, it was the, is the day. Okay, today, the current day, and uh, this way we uh, pick actually is the, your own day master. Okay, so you can actually pick them to see uh, this day is good for, what is it good for, for today. Okay, so normally uh, we will use uh, the current day and try to interact with our own little chart. Okay, then um, this is the element interplay that let you understand that um, uh, this is a little bit hard. I also uh, doesn't understand what, what is this. Yeah. So this is a little bit hard. This is uh, I didn't learn about this yet. Okay. So I can't tell you what is it, but it represents that uh, upward and inward. So I think the, the interplay is uh, about what is it good for today. Okay. So you can tap into the other side to see what kind of things that you can do. Yeah. Okay. Then you have the twelve goal. Yeah, 12 growth uh, means that uh, what is it for today? Yeah, heaven. Yeah, then um, today 12 growth is what? Yeah, then me. Then you can actually search, search the 10 of them. Yeah, what is it represent by it? Okay, so you yourself have to uh, tap a little bit more here to understand the 12 growth. It's no longer same with the old versions. Okay, no longer same with the old versions. Because the old versions that will tell you which is from growth. This you have to tap, you have to remember which is the element for you in your natal chart. Do I have yin wood? Do I have jia wood? Yeah. So uh, this also gives you a new perspective. You're learning 12 growth. Okay. So the puzzle interactions, um, this is the another kind of interactions with the, the, the day chart. So this, 
uh, this bottom is the old text about G Earth and uh, Sin Matter. Okay, so mainly only for copying. There's no English translations. Okay, so this is the, the symbolic, the meaning of symbolic for today. Yeah, okay. And then you can actually change to the year. Okay, the day nature symbolic to the current time and also to the year. Okay, so it depends on how much you remember. This is quite confusing. It doesn't tell you where is the interactions will be. Okay, so the old versions give you a better view. Okay, then the bottom part, uh, you will see all these uh, interactions for you to remember. Okay, for you to remember which is which. Is it the day one? Is it the, uh, is it the, the month one? then you have to do it yourself, okay? Remember, take notes of this, which is represented by which, okay? Then you can search it when you're doing the selections in the Amana. Remember the animal sign, okay? To use it by yourself, okay? So this part, the old versions is very better, okay? So uh, the day stream, this is the, the jar stream, okay? Then uh, the day melody is the, uh, is the nak yin, nak yin. For the day, for the day, okay. Not in have different kind of usage that are very hard to explain right now. If you are learning about that, this might be useful to you, okay. So this is uh, the overall for this uh date selections, okay. So there is nothing more, I think. Okay, so mainly this is it. So thank you, uh, if you guys is watching this, okay. So uh. Hope you guys learn more about this. Okay, so see you guys again for the next one. Thank you.